That's what you get when you sneak up on me. Hello everyone. My name is Garrett Ogember and welcome back to Skyrim Special Edition. This is the 28 Days Later mod. And we have a new character here. His name is Heimdall. After the Norse Guardian of the Bifrost Bridge. He is a powerful warrior. Or in this case, a knight. Yeah, there he is. Uh, he is sporting a brand new mod that I downloaded today. Is the Silver Knight Armor. Except for the helmet, because I wanted to show off his face. But he is really powerful. He has two heavily enchanted weapons early on. He's got an Eastern Dwemer Battle Axe with 310 fire damage. Which is going to hit hard. He also has an Eastern Dwemer War Axe. 249 magic damage, multiplied by 5 on the next hit after this kills the target. So he's going to be a combat master. Um, but to compensate his abilities a bit, we've given him a heavy armor increase by 248 points and a destruction spell cost reduction of 251%. Now the main reason I did that is not because he's going to be at least starting out, he's not going to be using magic too much, but it's going to lower the costs to recharge these weapons. So, without further ado, we're going to make our way out into the wilds of Skyrim, and we're going to activate the 28 Days Later mod, as is the custom. <sighs> okay, we're going to do Patient Zero, because I actually want to get somewhere for once. Um, we are not going to take a follower just yet. It would help, but I think we can do this without a follower. We're also going to tweak our Vivid Weathers. Okay. That's really... It's so, so dark still. Um, yeah, that, that is a bit of a problem. I have to tweak that again when the zombies show up because it's just, it becomes super bright. Alright, well, it's hard to see in first person, but that's because we have adaption on. You know what, I wonder if there's a way to turn that off. Okay, I'm back. I have adjusted the E and B adaption, so hopefully it's a little bit clearer for people. Um, there is some default adaption in the game, so that I can't really get rid of that, but I spent a good deal of time trying to figure this out, and I think I have cracked the code. Uh, so hopefully, we'll be able to see a lot better as long as I remember to turn it off. I had to actually, um, not only look up more things on adaption, but I had to turn off, um, well, I had, sorry, I had to change my INI file so that I could actually equip the ENB menu. So we just nuked that wolf. <laughs> I don't think he's going to be bugging us again. More wolves. Okay. Let's not get killed by the wolves. That would be really insulting. We are going to take damage even with the armor that we have. Apparently, 300 points of armor isn't a lot. Was getting messages earlier when I was trying to figure this out that uh, that may have been the last of them. So the zombie apocalypse has either begun or it just ended without my intervention. I don't know. I'm gonna believe though that White Run is being overtaken as we speak, <laughs> which is not really good for us. But hey. It happens. Hello, is there anyone in here? There's always someone in here. There's always a dog in here, too. Hi, doggy. How are you? <laughs> kind of hate how I can always get a hit on you. No matter what you do. Oh, you're done. <laughs> what a burny mess. I am so sorry. Okay, there is a chest. Other chest. You are out of lockpicks. Great! That's great news. I love that. I love when a plan comes together. Okay. Let's do this. 
Hey there. Hi. You're dead. Pretty much, pretty much one shot these guys. Um, we've just got to get cautious, be cautious, I should say, about getting hit. I mean, being hit is not good for us. It will cause us a lot of pain and anguish. Okay. Let's head on out of here. Da -da -da. Yeah, there's still some default uh, adaption. I don't think it helps that we have this giant light over our head. That's what happens whenever we use those enchanting things. They uh, really mess with the lighting. I think it'll be okay. Let's break out that war axe. Let's see how that does. I've never used this effect, at least that I can remember, so we need to see what happens if we kill an enemy. Uh, it's supposed to give us a next strike bonus, which honestly isn't going to be as significantly stronger, considering we already have a axe that deals fire damage. Like, every time it swings, it deals a lot of fire damage. So this is not going to be as powerful in the long run, but... It could give us a small advantage if we're dealing damage. I think this enchantment is intended for doubling up on your enchantments. So if you have this plus you know, straight out damage, it's just going to double your damage potential. What was, that? what was that? It's a guy in heavy armor sneaking around. Okay, well that killed him. Uh, and I think now the weapon has a powerful upgrade to it. Hi. Yep. Oh, it makes a sound every time it kills them. Damn, that's crazy. So, I guess on daggers, that would be even more ridiculous. I just cook and clean and do whatever what? it is they ask oh. of me. Does that include uh, playing with dummies? Really? It's a wizard. <laughs> that works. this up. Might as well. Hey there. Oh god. That's really strong. Um, I mean, every time we get a kill, it's doing five times that damage bonus. Jesus. That's crazy. This character's really powerful up close, but he's gonna suffer if he gets hit. Hi there. Oh, this is lovely. My turn. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Did I kill you? I must have. That was the sound of your death. Okay. Uh, there's not a whole lot in here. Just a few goodies here and there. That's all we could really ask for, is a few small goodies. This bandit fort is still filled with bandits. Okay. I don't know why it's so bright. Um, probably because we set the brightness? <laughs> nope, that's normal, apparently. Thank God I can adjust the settings. <laughs> Okay. Hi, sir. Um, there's a few of you left over. I can easily deal with you. The Silver Knight, Heimdall, is coming for you. Ow. Stop hitting Heimdall. being shot at. I see you. I know. I know you hate me. It's okay. Shh. We'll all be over... Ow. 
It'll all be over soon. Ow! <laughs> what am I gonna do? I'm going to axe you in the face. That's what you get when you sneak up on me. Don't sneak up on me. It will not end in your favor. Okay, so. Got a bunch of useless crap from them. Uh, got a level up. I think... Put some points in our armor, as is. We already have a lot of armor points, so... I mean, I think it, it's gonna help uh, when it comes to physical damage that we would take. We can still be taken down, though. I mean, I am taking damage. That's no secret. But our character is a powerhouse to be reckoned with. And I forgot to mention, he is a Imperial... No, sorry, wow. No, he's not an Imperial. He is a Stormcloak. And these guys apparently don't know it. Boom. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Um, yeah, no, I messed up. I was thinking about that last character that was uh, an Imperial, the Dark Side witch character with the lightsaber. I don't remember. Uh, my mind's a little slow today. I've had a very long day, so... I wouldn't be surprised if I tried to turn somebody into a vampire when my character's clearly not a vampire this time around. It'd be kind of funny. I think it would be funny. It's like, hey, yeah, I'm gonna bite- oh, I'm just slobbering all over your neck. That isn't working. I'm gonna see if there's any zombie bodies. Because there was signs of an attack. I don't see any, though. I see Sophia there. She seems like she's having a good nap. Um, hello? Hi, sir. No, I don't need a ride. Uh, well, if there were zombies, I don't know where they are now. They might have been erased. That's what could have happened. It's probably like one zombie, because I did start out with Patient Zero, I believe. See, I don't even remember what I started out with. That's how tired I am. Uh, so, that's a good indicator that... Uh, they might have been wiped off the map. Hey there, everyone. Hi. Well, that's taken care of. No oh. thanks to you. What? I wasn't here. Certainly not. That's why I'm here with my shoe. <laughs> and out an order of and we show up to solve okay. the Okay. Yeah, I, I believe you. I, I don't know why you guys are all admiring this giant though. Be a companion. Look at him. Looks oh, so sad. Such colors. Oh, such colors! I well, know, right? Would you like my little ball of light? No thanks to you. <laughs> I don't know where it came from, help me, please. The game crashed on me without any warning. Uh, I mean, I'm just... I am not in the mood for that. I'm so tired, I had a busy day, and the game decided to shut down without any forewarning whatsoever and then really it's so bright it really uh, aggravates me get dark please okay, there we go. I don't know it's just it is not just that it shuts down it's that when you're planning on doing something and the game just refuses your input well, that time, I got to jump on you. Um, yeah, it's, it's it's a little irritating, but that's what happens when you play with so many mods. I mean, when the, this game, um, when this version of the game first came out, it was super stable. And then I started modding it. Slowly over time, I mean, it's still more stable than the base game, but slowly, it started to get a little crazy. Things start to not work the way they should have. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> oh, I axed the crap out of him. 
Damn. That's awesome. Alright. You know what? Uh, can we use your forge here? Maybe I can break some things down. Oh, that's right. No, we need a smelter for that. Okay. Wait, no, we don't need... We don't need a smelter. No, we do need a smelter for metal. Oh, okay. Yeah, I am really out of it. <laughs> but I figured I would record while I was awake, and at least this one video. So it's one of those nights for me. It's a Thursday night. I want to relax. I want to play a game. I want to watch videos while I upload. And I think uploading is most of what I'm going to be doing tonight. Uh, not when you see this video, of course. When you see this video, it's not going to be that, that same Thursday. I will do these uploads and uh, other things in one whole night. I'm just going to fast travel there. I think the game was trying to render too much at once, and that's probably what caused it to crap out. Um, but we'll save at the stables. We'll level up. Give ourselves those armor points that we desperately need. Uh, at some point, we'll have to, if this character survives, we'll have to do the Jagged Crown quest and deal with that. Um, ow, my eye. Ah. Uh, we're gonna have to deal with that and see if we can actually do the main quest there uh, for it. I. Don't know. I mean, we have a lot of power, but we're limited to melee in that respect. I could go learn a lot of destruction spells in Riverwood, but we did that in the last uh, character, last episode. So we're not going to do that on this character. If we end up, if we end up going there, we may take one or two spells with us. But primarily, this character fights with melee weapons. I want him to be a strong boy. I want him to grow up knowing he can cut people in half. Can I, like, piss in the Battleborn's, uh, wine? Or ale? Ooh. Can unlock the door. We're not gonna sneak very well now that I think of it. We got this damn glowing light over our heads. And we're in heavy armor. We don't like Imperial Sporters. What do you think oh, doing? hi. Someone there? What are you gonna do? Call the guards? I cannot... I'm sorry. <laughs> you probably didn't deserve that, but, um... This is our house now. I wonder if we still have a bounty from that. I didn't see a uh, thing that said we didn't. It's like, who the heck saw me? Everyone's dead. I don't know. He may look like a pure individual, but Heimdall's got some darkness in him. He takes justice very seriously. And if you, uh, you go against his justice, well, you end up sleeping in bed like nothing ever happened. Dead, but... <laughs> okay, we are able to steal... So that means whoever else lives here is not dead. I don't know if we got away with that, though. That's the thing. I guess it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. We're gonna die no matter what we do. See, I think it's I think it's the second I stop trying is when I'm actually going to survive. That That's probably what's gonna happen. Hi there, who are you? Vigilance, huh? Vigilance? Oh, such colors. I know. Right? Yeah, it's amazing. I'm brighter than you. <laughs> How does it feel? I just committed a murder. Yeah, they don't care. Okay. Well, there is a war going on. Let's throw our axe into the mix. Oops. Made a mistake. Yes, you got it. Okay. Ow. What? What? I'm not a danger. <laughs> oh, there we go. <laughs> it all works out for the best. It all works out for the best. They were hunting werewolves. Cool. That's that's good to know. Um
Woodcutter's axe. Cool. Hey guys, how are you? I killed a guard. I knew it was a guard. I was just like, I don't know. <laughs> when I'm tired, I have nothing better to do. It doesn't matter who who's in front of me. They just they have to go down. They 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 must be taken down. It's just the the rule of thumb. Uh, bandits. Yeah, I think the guards are pretty okay with my presence. They don't seem to care too much. And there's not much they could do. I mean, if they mess with Heimdall, they mess with Fury Incarnate. I'm strong. Oop. Hi, how you doing? Probably wondering why... Why did you get Dwarven Axes? Well... Got a new mod, wanted to try it out. Looks pretty cool. I actually have the same mod, well, the same models that these are based off of. These are much higher resolution and shiny and actually more modern era. Um, but I have the mod for Morrowind that these are based off of. So I was like, ah, yeah, cool. I, I never use Dwemer weapons. I might as well use them. So we're using them now. Hey, Mr. Guard. Oh, look, it's Cicero. No, defend him. Stop. He's a murderer. He does bad things. Hold on, I gotta, I gotta set him on fire. It's fine. Okay. Well, I've wasted my time. Because they can't die. <laughs> as strong as our attacks are, I don't think I'm stupid enough to go fighting a giant or a mammoth. Especially the mammoths, because they've been upgraded as one of my mods, so... Actually, oh, the same mod upgrades giants, too. Yeah, so what am I talking about? That's like asking to die. No, we're not gonna, we're not gonna deal with them. That would just be bad for us. Uh, Heimdall isn't about that. He, he is all about taking his time. That is a big-ass spider. Let's try to take out the enhanced spider. Come on. Come at me. Okay. You still deal you still deal damage, but I can kill you now. It's good to know. Um, I thought I turned off adaption. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Yeah, uh, there it is. That's right. Okay. Nope. Apparently adaption's still on. What? Okay. I don't, um... I don't get this. Hey, look. It's normal sky... Oh, God. Oh, God. It looks ugly. Uh, enable adaption. Oh. Post pass. Wow. Okay. Uh, original post-processing. Oh. Oh. No. Um. Original Bloom. No. I have no idea. I don't. I don't know what's happening here. Adaption. Uh, adaption sensitivity. What the hell would happen? Color correction. I don't. I don't even know. My brain is far too tired to deal with this. Like how my character just swing his axe around. I don't know what PRT render is. Hello? Okay. Um Constance. Cool. Okay. I don't know how to open up all my other shit either. That's that's another thing. Like all the other options I had, they seem to have been blown out of the water. That's, I don't even know what's going on. Well, one thing's for certain: the night is beautiful. 
at that. Look at how pretty that is. Oh, so gorgeous. I don't know where I am or where I'm going, but... Oh, looks like we're heading backwards. Okay, I guess we're heading backwards then. I got turned around for some reason. <laughs> you know, I think this is a good time to get off because I am, like, losing my mind here. And it's so dark now. Oh. What? Uh, oh, God, what? Oh. Someone's firing an arrow at me. Oh, shit. It's you. You. <laughs> okay. Well, I... No, that's not what I wanted to do. Now that I know how to do it, I don't want to do it. Um, I need to get some rest. Because I am very tired and... I have no idea what I'm doing. So thank you all so much for watching. I hope you're enjoying the series so far. If you are, leave a like. And I will see you in the next episode. 28 Days of Skyrim. I'm sorry this episode is a little lackluster. I'm, uh... Like I said, I'm just not feeling the best. Um, it's just so over overtired. Overtired. Uh, staying up all day. Which is my night. So staying up when I should be in bed and then trying to resume a regular work schedule is kind of hard to do. Um, but I'll see you all later. Thank you for watching. And we'll see where Heimdall goes. Um, I'm not sure... I'm not sure how I feel about him. I normally don't play warriors. And I like his armor, but he's probably going to get killed. Hi there, sir. How are you? Are you angry? You have committed crimes oh. against the Sky Fine. Take me to prison. I don't care. I'll see you all later. Goodbye. They took me to Morth... Uh, to Dawnstar. To Dawnstar. They took me to Dawnstar. How do we... Hold on. Hold on a second. How do we get arrested... Like, around here? And end up... Go... Is it because he was a Dawnstar... Character? Oh my god, that is so weird. Hi everyone. It's me, Garrett. The it's Legion cold. taught us 